I just want to interrupt your day for a second to tell you about a course I'm running on the Thinker Blaise Pascal. Uh, I'm going to describe why I'm running the course and then um, hopefully if it's of interest you might want to join me. So basically I've always loved Pascal's work. Uh, he was seen as one of the greatest uh, scientists, mathematicians, uh, and inventors of his century, the 17th. In fact, at the age of 18, he invented the calculator just to help his dad pay his taxes, right? So a brilliant mind. But what he's most famous for is a series of fragments that he left behind for a book that he never completed. And those fragments have been gathered together in what's called the Ponce. And this book is praised as being one of the greatest uh, pieces of French literature. Uh, it's also seen as having some of the most profound insights into the human condition. Here you see Pascal as a type of proto-existentialist and proto-psychoanalyst, and have foreseen some of the insights that people like Kierkegaard and Freud would later have and develop and uh, go deeper with. So for example, Pascal incredibly writes about how we engage in self-deception and distraction uh, as ways to avoid confronting the difficulty and the pain of the human condition. He looks at a type of misery that we all experience, uh, mostly to do with three things. Uh, the fact that we're finite, uh, the fact that we live in relative ignorance, and the fact that we are immoral, that we don't live up to our own desires uh, and our own um, ideals. And because we can't face these facts, our finitude, um, our ignorance and our wickedness, we engage in all sorts of diversions. So Pascal outlines that he lays all of that bare in a very profound and clear and disturbing way. And then he offers a solution to the problem of the human condition. And in many ways, this answer uh, on the surface is less interesting and less profound than the question, right? So where he's at his best is in describing uh, the difficulty of being human. Um, however, what I want to do in this course is I want to look at his answer very carefully. Uh, people often dismiss it very quickly. So a careful look at his answer. And then I want to kind of do a paratheological reading of Pascal. I want to kind of isolate uh, a potential problem in his work, but also show that implicitly within Pascal is um, something more radical than I think even he understood. Uh, that within his answer, there is a better answer. <laughs> and that actually, if we read Pascal very carefully, not only can we get greater insight into our own existence, uh, into what it means to be human, but he does offer us ways in which we can affirm life, embrace existence, and live well. So if you're interested in doing the course, uh, it's going to be on my Patreon at Blaze level, which is the level where all my courses are. Uh, and that level gets you hundreds of hours of archive material, as well as access to all the hangouts and the book studies and the film nights and all the events that we do. But it will get you also this course, which starts on the 25th of June. Uh, you can either join live or everything will be recorded so you can get the classes after the fact. So hope you'll join me. Find out more in the link below and um, uh, get on with your day. Bye-bye.